Hi, my name is Christophe Charpentier, and I'm with the product management team and responsible for the LGS content. During this presentation, we will give you an update on the most important online maps and tasks Esri is serving to its user community. We will give you a status on the great resources available today and indications on what's coming next for those maps. Base maps are the foundation for so many of maps and applications. Let's start touring RGS Online collection of maps. One of the most popular RGS Online base map is the world topographic map. It's used by desktop, web, and mobile users and contains much of your work. It is both a global map and a very detailed local map. The world topo map is authoritative content at many different scales contributed by many users through a community participation program. It is a base map built by the community for the community using a framework to create a single unified map of the world. To find the world topo map simply search RGS Online using the keywords world topo. You will discover a wealth of content that is being updated monthly with over a thousand contributors from 40 countries around the world. To find more about the World Topo Map, simply go on rgs.com and search using the keywords World Topo. You will discover a wealth of content that is being updated monthly with over a thousand contributors from 40 countries around the world. The level of accuracy and detail in many locations is just simply amazing. Authoritative contributors range from national mapping agencies like the Dutch Cadaster to local cities and counties to even more detailed university campus scale maps. The base map is constantly expanding and evolving as more participants sign up to contribute every day. The Wall Street map is detailed multi-scale transportation base map designed to provide consistent display, geocoding and routing. Updates happen twice a year in the spring and in the fall. The last update resulted in significantly more coverage around the world. Using the keywords Wall Street on RGS.com, you will find the entire globe is available at a consistent 1 to 150,000 scale or regional level of detail. Zooming in further to a more detailed 1 to 20,000 scale, the spring 2011 release doubled the coverage of CD level data by adding many regions in the southern hemisphere. Latin America, Southern Africa, Australia and New Zealand, just to name a few. And for the most detailed scales, you will see the dark green areas representing very detailed CD level for thousands of major populated areas in the world. With the full update of RGS Online, both World Topographic Map and Wall Street Map offer detailed coverage countrywide for all countries covered and no longer just populated areas. Future releases will include expanding the coverage in Mid-East, all of Asia and more over the next year. Now, part of the Wall Street Map resources is also a global gazetteer. For place finding, the gazetteer has been expanded to more than 20 million places, including cities, towns, landmarks, hydrography, monuments, points of interest, and more. In addition, the place finding supports multiple languages, making it easier to find Moscow, Beirut, Bangkok, or Fukuoka in native languages. Next, for locating street addresses, we currently have great coverage for North America and Western Europe today. Since July 2011, RGS.com viewers and RGS mobile products are now both using a new geocoding API that Esri has just exposed. This new geocoding API is not yet publicly released, but it will add an additional 60 countries giving you high quality coverage for over 50% of the world population, with more to come in the future. RGS Online doesn't only offer physical maps, but also a large collection of descriptive maps such as demographics. Powering the community analyst is an incredible wealth of data on demographics and lifestyles. More than 20 different maps and more than 200 variables are also available for you as free resources from RGS Online. 
Introduced end of June 2011, the World Ocean Map is a beautiful bathymetric map providing a high-quality base map for the 71% of the world that we often forget. Like World Topo Map, World Ocean Map is designed as the framework for community participation so different organizations around the world can contribute their additional bathymetric data to create a unified map of the ocean. For any organization involved in maritime operations, the ocean base map provides the foundation for overlaying political boundaries, energy infrastructure, shipping activity, subsea geology, oceanography, charts, surveys, and more. It is the foundation for building an ocean GIS. Another one of the exciting new maps is coming in the fall 2011, and that is the National Geographic World Map. Developed jointly by National Geographic and the Esri Cartography team, this map brings to the web the distinctive National Geographic cartography that many of us have grown up with. The National Geographic map is a multi-scale base map that can be accessed on your desktop, server, and mobile devices. These maps can be used as a solid base map underlying your operational data and also as full intensity, bright, beautiful maps that are used to help communicate your stories, your work, and are the digital equivalent of the paper maps hanging on school walls. There are many great examples of large mosaic data sets published as image services on RGS Online. For example, MDA Information Systems has published the global Natural View Mosaic. This beautiful mosaic is a collection of 8,700 Landsat images, color corrected, creating a high quality accurate image service at the medium resolution scale. For high resolution imagery, World Imagery Map provides you with increasing coverage of one meter or better resolution data. We are in the process of adding 50 million square kilometers of Iconos imagery between now and end of the year. We will expand the high resolution dark green areas to include all the yellow areas, resulting in a six fold increase of high resolution imagery over the next six months, with more to follow. And the third source of imagery to discuss is the global Landsat service available on RGS Online. This service provides access to more than 34,000 scenes from the USGS Global Land Survey dataset. With access to all the band combinations and raw pixels values, you can easily create a variety of different products to address different analysis needs because imagery is not only about pixels, it is about information in those pixels. The Landsat service also provides access to the historical data going back 35 years, creating the definitive source for global change detection. The last base map I want to talk about is related to LiDAR and elevation. Coming in the fall 2011 is a global multi-resolution turn model on RGS Online. This service is being constructed from multiple sources, including SRTM, commercial radar, and community contributed high resolution LiDAR. In the past, RGS Online has delivered hill shaded terrain as cached maps. But this new service will be a dynamic mosaic of elevation data supporting not only visualization but also topographic analysis. Esri will first release a service built using public domain data in the fall, but will extend the reach by offering the capacity to license additional content from commercial vendors such as Intermap. We can wrap up our summary of RGS Online content by emphasizing that every day RGS Online continues to grow as a key part of the RGS system. We gave you an update on our base map efforts, but the real power is having nearly 100,000 users contributing maps and apps that can easily be shared and accessed across the community. RGS Online is every day more popular, with now over 25 million map tiles served to GIS users and applications. Thank you very much for listening to this presentation and this status on RGS Online content. And to start exploring and using this great content, go visit rgs.com. Thank you.